Assalamualaikum everyone. This is Abidin Labib. Welcome to our channel Oracle Apex BD with a brand new video. How are you everyone? Hope so good. So today we will make a dashboard using card template charts. Firstly, we have to go our welcome page. Then go to the page designer and create a region first in the body. Now we have to set the type in cards and then set the source type to SQL query. Then write the source code. The code shows you firstly select SL. SL means the serial number of your card and then you give you have to give the icon firstly go to chrome search the name of card icon you can also use the flat icon for best png image you must have to use png image here then click the right button and copy the image copy the image address you have to ensure that you are copying the image address and paste the image address under quotation before icon. Then name the title and the name the title bar. And then you have to set function of counting. Which type of data you want to show, which tables data you want to show, that type of you have to select the table. First write count then star mark in the bracket. This star mark count function will count all of your data from the table. Then type the table name which tables data you want to show. Then validate the code and save and run the page. Now the card is not showing yet because we did not set the attribute. So go to page designer and set the attribute. The attribute is in the cards the primary key is SL number. Then the title is total number and subtitle is title name. and go to icon type icon type is image url because we just gave a url there in sql query and the image url link is icon then save and run page now if you quick edit the card then you can change the styles so we set it to style b Now if we want to add multiple data or cards then what we have to do? We have to do the same thing in SQL query. Just all we need to do copy the query and paste it and just change the value keep the same column name and change the SL number also because you have to change SL number because you called it is in primary key. So you have to write this serial by serial and then you can add more data. Then you have to change the data and also with a different table name you can provide here. So follow this process for every card. If you want to add 3 or 4 more then you have to connect the cards with union function. Every card query ends you have to write union here because the union connects you to one card to another card. Now we have to make this card clickable. Clickable means when you press the card then instantly open a classic report or a report. Now we have to add another function in SQL query. So firstly go to the query 
then in SL1 you have to add here this code so basically this is a function to redirect to another page this is works as a URL so the apex page dot get URL in the bracket you have to enter p underscore page this page number must have a report so this is the number of page which contains a table of this class report now save and run page but it will not work eight because in this region we have to create a action So now create a action in region make this is in type is full cart the full cart means when you press anywhere in cart this action will work then select link convert this to redirect URL and then click in the target URL type and URL dot your card will now clickable so click the card this will redirect to your located page number so the cards uh, yes all the process we are done for cards now we will make a chart here so firstly create another region set the type in charts move to the option new there the source type is in SQL query so here we can see the sum sum will work for counting your data net amount is the column name which column name you want to calculate you have to provide that column name as value then name the level of your calculation then you have to enter the table name now goes for another one chart now you have to go column mapping then level is level select and the value is select value and then save and run page so here is the output the chart we have made here you can edit the axis or color from page designer now we will create filter date for this chart this filter will helps you to show the amount of selected date so create a new region and then on this region create two page item and two buttons now you have to name the item first one is from and the type is date picker and then another one is to and this type is also date picker now rename the button also one is clear and another one is search and then of the start neuro of filter region 
and set column span to level 3. Now we have to create a dynamic action in clear button. Dynamic action floor clear. First in clear set the action type to clear and selection type is from and to both. You have to select both. Now we have to link this filter region with chart region. So we have to do another query in that region. Let's do it. We have to create a query for the filter and another function is NVL. We have to put NVL here. So firstly which date we want to select date column of this table. So where the column name this is the pure date between and now we have to do nvl function here in bracket colon page one and this p1 will colon page one from the column name and another nvl p1 two and the column name and the bracket so same thing goes to this chart also just have to change the column name from the table Now if we select the date, this chart showed the selected date is. Now if we select the date, this chart will be shown this date data. Now if I select another date, so here no data available in this date. Now we have to create another true action which name is submit page it will helps you for when we don't select any date then the lifetime data will be shown here so now create action here and then save and run page Now if you want to add icon in this button, go to page designer and then select each button. Go to appearance, select template in text with icon. Then go to icon and type, close here and select an icon. Same process for the search button also. Now you can quick edit the style of this button.
so we are almost done here the cards and the charts are almost done hope so you enjoyed this video no more today inshallah in next video we will create more design for dashboard till then stay good and subscribe our channel for more videos and follow our facebook page for more updates about oracle epic allah Hafiz.